Here we go, I'm going to tell you how to fix that error, and um, I'll put a link in the description where you guys could get this right here. As I already have it, I'm just going to press install. Let's wait for that to install real quick. And what you want to do is open it. And it will ask you right here for super user request. What you want to do, of course, is grant it. And right here is just talks about the busy, busy box. Hello, welcome to the busy box pro. It looks like the initial setup has not been completed yet. The initial setup will take a bit longer than busy box free. The first time it is run because we are making a backup of your system as well as doing some additional checkups on your system. After the initial setup is complete, start startup times should be very easy. Thanks for your patience. So right here, it's loading up on the top right here, 45, 46%. I'm just gonna wait for that to load up real quick. Then I'm gonna, I'm gonna press the install button. And that will install my busy box into my phone. And I'll be able to use DSploit to hack and have fun with other networks pranking your friends or something like that. I'm not responsible if you get in trouble doing the busy box thing. So it is under your risk of getting in trouble and stuff. So don't blame it on me if you get in trouble. So here we go, we have the screen done uploaded. What I always do is auto update BusyBox. I want to check that because of course we want the latest versions of the BusyBox. Then I'm going to press install. And it's going to install BusyBox right here. You hear it installed, as you guys can see. Let's go back into the DSploid and see how it goes here, right here. As you guys could see, it works all perfectly fine and stuff. So, yeah guys, um, that error didn't pop up or anything, so... Thank you guys for watching this video, and I hope this was helpful to you if you had the error. And I know this one person asked me, so I hope this video explains to you.